All right, hi guys, and welcome to WeFlick Fishing. Today, we're gonna to show you how to cook and clean a flathead starting from scratch. So, starting, grab your flathead. We're gonna fill with them, we're gonna crumb them today. Starting, we have to fill with it, obviously. So, you whack your knife behind the fins like so, cut down to his bone, and then run your blade along that backbone. You try and keep your blade as flat as you can, and you minimize any wastage of meat. Fortunately, I haven't got a proper filleting knife today, so I might be a bit of a butcher myself, but we'll see how we go. All right, so that's, that's filleted. Now to skin it. Don't cut the fillet off the bone. Flip the fillet over, keep it connected to, uh, by the skin. Now, by the tail, you cut down to the skin. Flatten your blade and basically cut along and hold on to the skin at the same time. Okay, so fill it is filleted and skin, now debone. To debone it, you'll put the fillet upside down, you can run your hand along his bones, you'll feel where they are. So what you do then is put the knife to the edge of those bones and run it straight down. Little hint is to angle it towards the bones because the knife generally won't cut through it and you'll get every bit off without getting any wastage. So that's one side. There's his ribs, minimal wastage. There's the fillet completely done. So repeat the same thing with the other fillet. Okay. With these fish, we like to rinse them in the water they came out of, so we just give them a little bit of a rinse in some fresh water. Okay, there we have the fillets. Now, for the process of cooking it. Starting with egg. Should I say flour? I like to give it a light dip in the flour, get him inside his little flats where you've deboned it, shake it off into the egg. Into the breadcrumb. So there's one piece ready to go. There we go, ready to go on the fire. So we go work this one on. All right guys, now it's time to put them on. I like to get a bit of fire happening underneath. I like really hot oil because they're not thick fillets and you like to get a crunchy outside, but you don't want to overcook the flatties because they're very thin at the tail. And it's probably one of the best bits. So probably about right heat now. Just chuck them on. Move them a little bit off the pan so they don't stick. The preferred method is to use like a glove or something like that. This is all we have. We don't want to burn ourselves. Just flick the oil around, give it an even amount of oil so they cook evenly. And they shouldn't need, need long, only a couple of minutes, a couple of minutes either side, if that. They're very small fillets, so it won't take long. Okay, I think these will be pretty good to flip out now. It's been on for about a minute and a half, two minutes if that. Flick them over, nice crispy gold coating on the other side. Oh, one's a bit overdone. Okay, now the other side's been, been on for about a minute, just enough to give it a nice crispy layer. 
it's basically ready to serve. So we'll put them on, on the tray next to us just to droop any access, excess oil off them so they remain crunchy. And they're cooked, ready to go. All right, guys, so we have our flatty pieces. They're finished now. I'll let them cool off for a little bit. Uh, I've got a salad that Joel prepared a little bit earlier, so we'll serve that up. Put the salad down. Fish on plate. Couple of pieces of lemon. Very simple way to cook up flathead. Very nice meal. Bit of salad, bit of flathead. Goes real nice with lemon. I'm gonna leave you now because I'm starving and I wanna chow it down. So thanks for watching. Um, do you want any more information on cleaning the fish? Uh, we've got another clip we just put on. So follow us on Facebook at Wee Flick Fishing. Um, hope you enjoy and hope it was very educational. See you later, guys.